Well, I, I personally, I'm no fan of Vladimir Putin. I think he looks in the mirror and he aspires to be Vladimir the Great. He'd love to put the USSR back together again. Uh, the situation that we face, the reality with Russia, happens to be very complex. Right now we're talking cybersecurity, cyber attacks. Uh, but I just got back from Afghanistan yesterday. Uh, in that region, Afghanistan, Pakistan, Syria, Turkey, uh, it's a challenging graph uh, map, the entire world right now with uh, those challenges. So um, isolated to what's gone on over the course of the last couple of days, I do believe Putin is outsmarting President Obama uh, with his response. Uh, he has been allowed to take the high road, be magnanimous. Uh, it's it's Congressman, unfortunate. Is it, really now taking, we need to move is it really taking the high road if you're the one who's first accused of starting this whole thing by hacking into our election system? Oh, this is just a, a very, um, you know, it's like, it's like a complicated inside baseball uh, game that, uh, that Putin, with his messaging, uh, using Twitter, communicating with the rest of the world. I mean, you look at the realignment right now in the Middle East where, right. uh, you know, Syria is, there's a truce being negotiated with Russia and Turkey and the United States isn't even involved. Um, so I think it's more of a messaging outsmarting over the course of the last couple of days. Uh, and, and but you know it's it's impossible to defend the guy though.